what's up guys and welcome back to the happiest channel on youtube and today's video to teach you guys a brand new glitch that allow you guys to save the valentine's day outfit after the patch 1.32 for the next generation consoles so with that being said guys let's get right into it Alrighty, guys so welcome back and let's get started so the very first thing you guys have to do is have a friend instead of a rockstar created race now make sure you just sit in the lobby guys and does not start the race up as normal just simply make the lobby open then go ahead and just sit there until you guys invite your friend to that mission but once you guys have a friend instead of a rockstar created race and he's actually just sitting there that's all he has to really actually do so now from this point what you guys have to do is actually start off the brand new adversary mode which is actually known as till death do us part number one now in case you guys have no idea as to how to do this click start go to line go to jobs click on adversary and then go ahead and scroll all the way down to till death do us part number one so after you guys click on this and it starts up as normal you guys get to the lobby make sure you guys set the rounds to one then go ahead and invite three other players so after you guys have all the requirements, you can now start the mission up as normal and pick your favorite outfit to actually save into GTA 5 Online. Now for today's video, you guys can pick from the green outfit or the orange outfit. Now for me, I'm going to go with the green outfit so because I think it looks way better. Now after you guys complete the mission as normal, wait till you guys get to this screen right here, then like it, then after that, just simply go into your party settings and join your friend that's inside that Rockstar Creator Race or have him invite you guys to his Rockstar Creator Race. Now after you guys accept this invite, just to wait a few seconds and until you guys see the random job selection screen now disappear. Now once it does disappear, make sure you guys spam your button to actually accept it over and over again until you guys see it actually accept extremely fast. So basically spam A or X under controller the entire duration after you guys see the random job screen now disappear. And if done correctly on the bottom right screen it should say joining GTA 5 online session, it will now put you guys into your friend's Rockstar created job. And then from that point just to be back out as normal and then after you guys get back to a random online session, you should now have that Valentine's Day outfit. So it's a pretty damn epic glitch guys and overall very very easy to do. And that's pretty much it for today's video guys. So that's all you guys gotta do to get the Valentine's Day outfit and the brand new Adversary Mode outfits. I can never say that whatsoever. I apologize for that. I know I constantly say Anniversary but it looks like, I don't know, Adversary or something like that. I cannot say it whatsoever but sorry about that guys but that's how you got those outfits from the brand new Adversary Modes from the Valentine's Day update. So as always guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you guys did, please share your support. And last year to shoot for a massive like, go of 200 likes on today's video. So once again guys, thanks for watching and have a great day.